And following updates out of Cincinnati, doctors with URMC here in Rochester who specialize in this type of care talked about what the next steps in DeMar Hamlin's recovery might look like. Alex Love talked with those specialists today and joins us now from the newsroom with their analysis. Alex. Yep, the progress keeps coming, Adam. URMC's cardiac care team credit the training staff immediately giving CPR to DeMar Hamlin on the field as the reason why he made it this far recovering. The next phase will be finding out how this happened, which could uncover a genetic heart issue. Because Bill's safety, DeMar Hamlin, is only 24, doctors don't believe he suffered from cardiac arrest or other heart problems in the past. So his medical team in Cincinnati is likely to look for other signs. Could it be something genetic, something that he may have been born with? We don't know that, of course. Or could it be some a, a, a trauma to the chest that induces a cardiac arrhythmia, leading to cardiac arrest? Yes, those are very, very rare. Doctors at URMC explain keeping his body temperature normal is key to keeping his brain healthy. And at their facilities, they always begin monitoring temperatures as soon as the patient is brought in. We will help the team who's going to be admitting the patient determine what level of temperature management should be um, started for that patient. But it's very helpful to us to see how the brain changes and how the neurologic exam changes over the course of their admission. Although it's too early to tell if Hamlin's heart suffered any permanent injuries, because of his age and athletic ability, they say it can still fully recover. Because he received treatment immediately on the field, doctors anticipate he's not at risk of facing setbacks. Younger the patient, the healthier the patient, those people tend to recover better after a, a catastrophic event like this. Older patients, people who already have other heart problems, their recovery in, typic, uh, in general, typically won't be as good. URMC's cardiac care team has seen patients take as long as 18 months to have their hearts and brain fully recover after going into cardiac arrest. But in the end, they don't believe DeMar Hamlin would be this far along if it weren't for receiving CPR right away on the field. Adam? Alex, thank you so much. And those doctors, of course, emphasizing the importance of learning CPR. To hear the latest from Hamlin's medical team in Cincinnati, visit rochesterfirst.com.